All right, guys, so we do a lot of stuff at the dealership on a regular basis, and I know it's exciting, and you guys can't get enough of the cars, but today we're gonna do something a little bit different. I'm here with Holly. Holly's one of our new managers. What's going on? Nothing much. I just wanted to uh, celebrate Beaver Creek. The high school girls just won nationals um, in the dance competition. One of them happens to be my little cousin, so I thought it'd be kind of cool if we could come and wish her congratulations, and uh, also all the girls in Beaver Creek. So we're gonna go and we're gonna talk to these girls, and we're not gonna talk about cars for this segment. <laughs> How awesome is that? You know why? Because we really want to talk about the community, because that's that's kind of part of what we do. We're, we're community oriented. We're gonna be featuring stories like this. We're gonna call it SDG Off the Clock. Off the clock. And if you don't see this segment next week, then the segment is off the clock. But for now, <laughs> Holly, take it away. All right, follow me. We're going to go over here and say congratulations to all the girls. We're super excited for them. They've been working their butts off. So over here is the varsity team. We actually have a varsity and junior varsity. Both of them separately won at nationals. So this is the varsity team right here uh, performing the dance that they did at nationals in Orlando, Florida. And now over here, we have the Junior Varsity team performing their session of what they did uh, in Lexington, Kentucky recently for the Junior Varsity Nationals. Uh, so we're all super excited. And this is the very first year that they've had a Junior Varsity team at Beaver Creek. So it's an honor that they got to go all the way to Nationals this year. All right, I am here with Casey, who is the coach of the dance team here in Beaver Creek. Casey, if you don't mind telling me, what was the process and what did you guys have to go through to get to Nationals? Well, we have two teams this year. Our JV team went to Jam Fest Dance Super Nationals in Kentucky. And then um, our varsity team went to the National Dance Team Championship in Orlando, Florida. And for the National Dance Team Championship, it's a process of getting a bid and we get a bid at camp. And then you work all year. So we've been dancing since May. And um, this year, our varsity team did really great. Our palm routine, we finished at semifinals and we were 16th in the nation. And our jazz routine, we made it to finals and we finished 15th in the nation. That is incredible. Yes. So it's it's very exciting. It's a lot of work. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, definitely. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Definitely. And I also wanted to talk to Sage, who is the captain of the varsity team. So I hear you're a senior this year. Yes, I am. How excited are you? Very excited. Now, did you get scholarships or anything like that? Um, um, through or? academics, yes. Oh, okay, very nice. Um, and then how many other seniors and juniors are on this um, team? There is senior Jojo, she um, co-captain with me, and then we have two juniors, Taylor and Elizabeth. Okay, very nice. And what did you guys feel like in nationals right when you guys were heading on stage? It was the most amazing feeling, just like everyone being connected as a team. We're all just huddled up like a good 20 minutes before and just to keep your energy up, we're all just doing songs and dances and it was just the most amazing feeling. Like I would do anything to go back to that moment. Well, keep up the great work, ladies. And there is one more person that I would like to talk to real quick, Kayla Begley. Come on over, my little buttercup. <laughs> this is my little cousin. Um, I don't know if it's okay that I say that, but I love her. And that's actually how I found out about you guys. Um, it's through family was talking recently about um, you know some things going on. And when I heard about my little angel growing up and <laughs> winning in the nationals and stuff, I said, oh my gosh. So I went to, to Steve Van Gorder from SVG and said, hey, um, you know, I really would love to do a piece and just wish congratulations to all the girls. And you know, I know that they work hard and they deserve it anytime we hang out with family. Her and some of the other girls are always doing their routines and <laughs> it's mind blowing to me, definitely. So I know they work their booties off and she's been doing it since she was like two or three. So I'm sure all of you guys have. So uh, I just want to say congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Well, that's all for this week. Hope to see you. You know what? Did you notice the colors? Orange? <laughs> Aren't you glad they got the same colors we do? How cool is that? Everybody wears orange, that's all I'm saying. <laughs>